Here we go then, heat number seven. Smarzlik on the inside, does his bike work better this time? Yep. It sure does, that bike worked a treat. Fars himself to the corner, up the banking, hits the dirt, tight down the back straight with Huckenberg coming on. He's having to work hard, the world champion, to get across him there. Just about does it, we've got Vasilik back in third place with Wozniak out the back. But the change of bike, a bit of soul searching going on in the world championships uh, pit corner. And this works a treat here in heat number seven. Now, Hulkenberg putting Schmalzik under plenty of pressure on the opening lap, but Schmalzik now just seems to be settling into the race. Very rare, actually, during a meeting that we see Schmalzik changing bikes. He's normally very good at making decisions from the uh, qualifying practice, normally makes the right choices. But uh, rolling the dice early here, nice move oh. there from Martin Vasilik. Up the inside of there now, Hulkenberg paying the favour back. Oh, my goodness gracious me, that was <laughs> tough. Hulkenberg took no prisoners there, replaying the combat. And some, but for Bartosz, <laughs> goodness what a ride gracious me. me! Goodness gracious me! How on earth did Bashelik stayed on his bike? I'm not really quite sure. Can Bartosz Schmarzlik produce a minor miracle here off the outside? We're going to find out very shortly. What a start from Cabrera! That's fantastic off the inside. Here comes uh, Smarzlik round the outside. That's worked nicely for him. He's in the second. Can he hit the front? Cabrera's there momentarily. Cabrera running nice wide. Move. Here comes Smarzlik with a classic turn back. But Cabrera, that bike has worked well. Really good battle out in front between the two the Polish riders. But out in front, Cabrera, a finalist last time out in Prague, looking good. Yeah, Cabrera looking good, but he knows he's got Smarzlik right behind him. He'll be able to hear him there. Now, look, two different approaches. You've got uh, Cabrera riding the dirt line, Smarzlik up the inside. Cabrera realised, actually, as, as early as the first lap, that he's going to have to move out. Oh! Look at this. Oh! Look at this. He's going to have to speed Cabrera, oh! but he's going to have to cover that inside. Cabrera on the outside. He's in trouble. Bartosz Smarzlik's giving him racing room, and that is a sensational ride from the outside gate. Can Cabrera? Come back at him. No, he can't. Smarzlik at his best there in difficult conditions. Here we go then. A massive race here. What a start from Wolfenden. Absolutely brilliant into the first corner. Beauty's up the banking. Here comes Lingren now in the third place. Smarzlik is at the back. Wolfenden hits the front. He's had a disappointing night so far. Beauty has read oh, that nice beautifully. Move. But Wolfenden, yeah, Beauty got that. I tell you what. Perfect timing for Bewley for the cutback. Oh, comes now Wolfenden now is under massive pressure. Yeah, Wolfenden's going to come under pressure inside, outside. Lingren, Smarzlik behind him. Smarzlik with plenty of work to do. Oh, look at the speed. He's got off that corner. Done one. I've got a feeling he's going to get past Ty Wolfenden as well. Bewley may be a stage too far. Bewley out in front, looking great. Wolfenden initially away, very sharpish on the inside. Smarzlik working really hard. Here he comes with Freddie out the back. Wolfenden running wide, Smarzlik reads it, squares the corner off, tight down the back straight. What a speedway race again we're witnessing here in heat number 14. Proper speedway in Sweden tonight. Smarzlik's looked good tonight. First Lambert at times. Oh, Smarzlik's missed it completely out of gate number three. It's Lambert who hits the front. He fires himself to the front, and Max Frick coming into second place. Smarzik's a fair way behind here in third place, but Robert Lambert off that inside gate, terrific. Smarzik working hard on the outside, round the outside of Frick. Here we go again from the world champion. Yeah, it's a long way round there, but he's generating a lot of speed. He's now got himself level with Max Frick. I think he's got a chance of hitting the front. Frick a little bit quicker around the inside on that turn. See his nose is there. He's had a look across his right shoulder, and Smarzik sticking with it. Look how close oh. Oh, oh, there's no room there. Crikey! That was tight down the back straight. Fair play to Frick. Frick could have made that really, really awkward for Smarzlik. He did try. But Smarzlik's through in the second base. But for how long? Here comes Frick again. Oh, it's tight as they go through the final corner. But for Robert Lambert, he finishes his qualifiers off in style. Stuff from Lambert absolutely nails it. Smarzik's there with him. Round the Cabrera, outside, Kubera. Kubera coming on. Will he get the better of Smarzik? Yes! Oh, oh that's tight. tight! Oh, what a move. Kubera, absolutely top draw stuff. Relegates Smarzik to the back when Smarzik's not out of it. Look at Smarzik go round the outside. Fantastic oh, speedway. 
Beautiful from Spicer. Look at the response. He's probably going to hit the front now. Lambert covering off the inside. And now Smilesick's just letting the uh, horse oh. as it rains. Oh, look at that for a move. Tell you what, he could come out of this corner in front. Bartosz Smarzlik is the front. Robert Lambert tried to cover it, but the world champion just about hanging on. Look at now, Lambert's coming back at him. Oh, this is tight stuff. <laughs> Sensational, you're both through. You don't need to be doing that. But Robert Lambert and Bartosz Smarzlik, who has ridden very, very well tonight, they are getting the better of Kubera and Andre Lebedevs, and the world champion makes his fifth final of the season. Five out of five for that man. The grand final in Manila. Three lights on. Oh, what a Frick. start for Frick. Oh, Smarsnik. Smarsnik's there, but he's gone wide. Very wide indeed, Frick. Oh, here he comes. Here he here comes. comes. Roaring round the outside. Frick oh, wants he's it. gone back. Look at that. Oh, Smarsnik fires himself to the front. Lambert's coming through in the third frame. Frick hits the front again. again. Oh, oh, fantastic oh, Lambert Speedway. Can you believe it? Tell you what, Smarsnik. He was so committed there for those opening two, two corners first lap, but he got both wheels very close to going over the line coming into that corner, uh, turn one on the second lap. So it's going to be interesting to see that again. But Max Frick is going to keep working that inside as his only opportunity. Smarzik's got the bit between his teeth. He wants that first win of the season. Smarzik out in front. What a moment for him. And the context of the World Championship with Jack Holder back in fourth. He is going to pull further away the championship chase. This is a defining moment in the championship in 2024. The champion is the champion in Sweden tonight. What a performance. He had a dreadful draw. Two gate fours and a gate three. He picked up huge points from there. Brilliant, right. And Bartosz Smarslik back to his best tonight. And look how he celebrates. The team will be overjoyed with that. By his standards, it's been a long time coming this year to round five before he wins one, but boy, did he win that one. What a ride. What a ride with Frick. 